So today we're going to have a quick look at the context of Macbeth. So Macbeth has be, uh, can be classified as a tragedy, and tragedies are plays that tell a story about people who make errors and suffer. Now, most tra in most tragedies, the main characters die at the end, and this does happen in Macbeth, uh, sorry, to Macbeth and Lady, Lady Macbeth. So if you think about the concept of a downfall, tragedies are stories um, about the downfall of the character. And this means that these characters begin the play in happy situations and end up in terrible ones. So in Macbeth, Macbeth is viewed as the hero at the start who he receives praise from his comrades because he brutally killed their enemies. He is a hero and, uh, for killing the enemies of the king. Now later on, he begins to kill people for his own selfish needs, benefiting one but uh, no one but himself and causing tragedy for other people and their families. So just to recap that, Macbeth can be, tra uh, can be classified as a tragedy. And if you can think about downfalls in a few ways, so first of all, like the concept of a downfall is that the character begins the play in a happy situation and the character ends the play in a terrible situation. And in Macbeth in, in particular, at the start of the play, he's viewed as a hero for killing the enemies of the king. And later in the play, he begins to kill people for his own selfish needs. So here are some of the common causes of tragedy. So sometimes in the wider forces in the world that cause tragedy, things like chance happen. So in this play, fate and prophecy causes a lot of the tragedy. And if the witches had not revealed the prophecy, um, would any of the murders have happened? Who knows? So it is because Macbeth's fate is revealed to him that he becomes obsessed with achieving it. And if Macbeth had not known his fate, do you think he still would have, um, this still would have been his fate? Possibly not. So sometimes it is the villains who cause tragedy. So Macbeth and Lady Macbeth are the villains. And after the witches reveal their prophecies, um, Macbeth can see a way to seize power and decides to act on it no matter what the consequences are. Now Lady Macbeth encourages Macbeth to murder King Duncan uh, and she, because she also wants power and does not care how she gets it. Now, King Duncan trusts Macbeth as a friend, but Macbeth sneaks up on the king, on King Dun Duncan, while he is sleeping and defenseless, and murders him. Now, when Macbeth is named King of Scotland, he begins to crave even more power, and he worries that Banquo and his sons will uh, someday seize power. So he hires men to murder them. And fearing that uh, Macduff will cause problems for him, he sends men to Macduff's castle to murder him and his family. And when Macduff is not there, so the murderer kills his wife and son instead. Now Macbeth is responsible for the murders of his friends, innocent women and children, and the King of Scotland. Um, so he, that is the, the, how the tragedy unfolds. Now often tra uh, tragic characters bring about their own downfall and they have a, a flaw or an error in their character such as uh, ambition or immorality which makes them uh, make mistakes or lose judgment. So if you, uh, something to think about is do Macbeth and Lady Macbeth bring about their own downfall? Well their decision to chase power and ambition lead to them murdering or being responsible for the murders of many people and the guilt from these murders then leads to Lady Macbeth to commit suicide and Macbeth's murder of Macduff's family in, attempt, in an attempt to secure his power leads to his own death. Now Macbeth and Lady Macbeth, but Macbeth suffer in their own greed and bad judgment and Macbeth's chase for power means that he loses his own wife and also that other people try to stop him because he keeps killing everyone he feels threatened by. So ultimately, he causes his own downfall. So the causes of tragedy in Macbeth. So tragic 
characters with flaws. Often tragic characters bring about their own downfall. Errors of characters such as ambition or immorality cause them to make mistakes. And fate and prophecy. So if the witches had not revealed the prophecy, would any of the murders happen? And villains, this is what Macbeth and Lady Lady Macbeth are in the play. To recap those so common causes of tragedy, you've got wider forces like fate, villains, and tragic characters who have flaws. Now, Macbeth can be cl classified as a tragedy, and tragedies are plays that tell stories about people who make errors and suffer. In most, uh, in most tragedies, the main characters um, die at the end, and that happened in Macbeth. Uh, to Macbeth himself and to Lady Macbeth. So, some features of Macbeth's downfall. First of all, he's viewed as a hero at the start and a villain at the end. And he begins to kill people for his own selfish needs later on in the play. <laughs> 